Honorable Ministers of Zimbabwe and Rwanda, business leaders from both our countries, good afternoon to you. Although you have been here a few days already, I want to welcome you to Rwanda. This ga gathering is special. For a number of years now, Rwanda and Zimbabwe have been working to deepen the ties between our countries. Your presence here is the latest step in that journey and a significant one too. I take particular note of the ministers from Zimbabwe who have accompanied this delegation. I thank you all for your commitment. Be assured that the Rwandan private sector is ready to reciprocate and work with you to identify mutually beneficial business opportunities. The history of both our countries has been marked by moments of adversity and tragedy, but also success and resilience. In that, we are part of the wider African experience. Progress does not come easily or without sacrifice. It requires hard work, dedication, and self-reliance. But self-reliance does not mean being alone. No country on our continent can prosper without cooperating within our region. We have to come together, pool our resources and knowledge and reinforce one another. The African Continental Free Trade Area provides us with a clear framework to align our interests and our strengths. But the best rationale for collaboration, as we have seen during this conference, is that we have a great deal to offer each other. So let's make the most of it and act on the outcomes of this conference with a sense of urgency. Before I end my remarks, two things. One, uh, I had in the presentations made to us, uh, very important things we can do together and what each country offers and so on and so forth. I wanted to emphasize uh, one thing. Uh, I think it is the deputy CEO of VARADB who mentioned in the passing the, what 
Zimbabwe can offer uh, in the area of education. You talked about uh, equipment uh, or something. Uh, before equipment, I want people. I think Zimbabwe can offer us uh, uh, good teachers. So please uh, work on that uh, with a sense of urgency, since this is what we said. Uh, we can find whatever number you find of quality teachers, I think we, we can absorb. Be, be, because we need them. We need them uh, urgently. The second is uh, I want to send a message friendship and uh, brotherly relations uh, through the delegation of Zimbabwe, the ministers, please give uh, His Excellency, my brother, uh, President uh, Emerson Munangagwa, my Greetings and best wishes. Thank you very much.